Hey guys, RTT back here for another video. Guys, today we actually have some leaked images. We have two leaked official brochures of the Galaxy Fold 3 5G and the Galaxy Flip 3. So very, very awesome. Of course, both of these will be announced on August 11th at 7.30 p.m. But for right now, these are what the brochures look like. So let's go ahead and start off right away. They are starting off right away for the Galaxy Fold 3. We have three different colors. We have a fan Phantom Black, Phantom Green, and Phantom Silver. Very interesting. Uh, you go from com compact to impact, obviously with the gigantic screen being a lot more durable, as we know, than the previous version, the Galaxy Fold 2, with having S Pen support, which is very, very awesome. Also, it says, don't sweat it. It's water resistant. Now it is water resistant, but it's not uh, dust resistant. Keep that in mind. It is IPX8, X being no rating for dust uh, dust resistance, but obviously eight being water resistant. So it can be submerged up to one meter in water, which is really, really interesting. So the upcoming Samsung uh, Galaxy Fold 3 will feature a massive 6.28 inch uh, super AMOLED uh, touchscreen display, but since it was a it will be a affordable phone It will be easier easy to use Galaxy Fold 3 will be powered by the latest flagship Qualcomm uh, Snapdragon 888 processor called that in my one video Let's go. This new foldable smartphone will be available in three stunning colors. There are Phantom Black, Phantom Green, and Phantom Silver. What further, uh, further interesting is that for the first time, a Galaxy Fold device will uh, get at Samsung S Pen 2. Wait, a Galaxy Fold device will get an S Pen 2. So we all know this uh, from a preview I made is that there is a foldable S Pen. So it's not actually foldable, but it's called the foldable S Pen because it comes out and is launching with the Galaxy Fold 3. Galaxy Fold 3 camera features, a uh, camera features and battery. The upcoming new Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 3 will feature a triple camera setup on the real. The foldable smartphone will uh, support a 12 megapixel wide angle camera, a tried, uh, 12 megapixel ultra wide angle lens and a 12 megapixel telephoto sensor at the front it will have a dual camera setup this will be a 10 megapixel cover camera and a 4 megapixel under the display camera uh, this upcoming uh, smartphone is also expected to pack a bigger battery than its predecessor. Also, it's awards first uh, water-resistant foldable phone with an IPX8 rating. Obviously, like I said before, X being there's no rating for dust resistance. Usually how it works is IP, dust rating, and then the water rating. All right, so this is what the cameras look like. As you guys can see, we have 12, 12, 12, we have four, and we have 10. So very interesting indeed, actually. Um, yeah, that's interesting. So when you have the phone closed, you have a 10 megapixel camera. Uh, when you have it open, you have a four megapixel camera. So that's interesting, actually. Uh, right here does show make hard work look easy with the S Pen support. That also does, like I said before, means that this display will be a lot more durable. It will be a lot better overall. All right, so expected prices. We talked about this in another video, but pretty much what we can expect, this is uh, showing it in euros, but it's going to be around $2,200 USD. I think it's around, I th believe the euro conversion there is like 2000 to 2200 USD um, for the transition from 128 to 256 gigabyte, uh, which is still a lot of money. Let me, be, let's be honest. This is going to cost you an arm and a leg to get. That's just how it works. Like, it's not going to be cheap, okay? Two grand, two plus grand for this device. I'm going to be picking it up, but I'm probably going to be paying it off until I'm like 70 years old. Not really, but still, guys, it's going to be quite the expensive device. Our second brochure right here is going to be for the Galaxy Flip 3. Now, this actually is a more interesting brochure. So anyway, though, let's take a look at what we can see from this brochure. So starting off right away, we have our images on the screen of the Galaxy Flip 3 5G. Uh, we have a 1.1 inch display on the outside of the phone. We also, of course, do have a very beautiful phone. Uh, now, keep in mind that this is not going to 
uh what's it called it's not going to have s pen support but it will be water resistant not dust resistant same thing as galaxy fold 3 all right so on the outside you guys can see that you can now use this outside phone to out uh, the outside 1.1 inch display to actually do stuff like uh, obviously you have music one your weather your notification your messages all that kind of cool stuff you can really customize the outside of this which i think is absolutely awesome of course they're showing you this in i guess it would be called tent mode or i don't know what this would be called i guess is it no it's i know it's laptop mode like this it's laptop mode when you have it like this so very very cool um it also is going to go ahead and have the snapdragon 888 processor so same thing in the galaxy fold 3 will be in this phone too it measures in at 4.2 inches inside the galaxy flip 3 will also have a 6.7 inch primary display which we super amoled unit and it will have a 1.9 inch external display my bad I thought it was 1.1 inch it's actually 1.9 inch yeah all right camera features and battery the flip 3 will get a dual camera setup at the reel just like the original z flip at the reel it will have two 12 megapixel camera sensors one of them being a wide angle and one of them being an ultra wide angle at the front it will have a 12 or uh, 10 megapixel camera for selfies and videos the galaxy flip 3 will be the world's first water resistant foldable phone obviously alongside the Fold 3 uh, with a IPX8 rating. The upcoming smartphone is also expected to have a bigger battery than its predecessor. Awesome. And we see right here the cameras on this phone. We have two on the outer display and we also have one on the inner display, uh, which is, to be honest, looks absolutely beautiful. Now, the price tag of these are going to go ahead and be around 1300 to 1500 USD. Obviously, you guys can see the euros right there, 1099 to. Um, 1149 now keep in mind that this is there's never a direct comparison when it comes to euros to usd there is a conversion where you can look exactly how much it would cost in one area to the other but again we could also see you know it say 1099 euros but in america the price is completely different this is just based on conversion but again like i said i do expect this these both these phones to actually be a little bit cheaper than what i've listed but those are the conversion prices so if you want to know the actual conversion prices it's 1300 and 1500 guys tell me down below your thoughts and opinions i definitely am interested to hear it uh very very awesome information we got i can't wait to the 11th so we can actually see these phones on the screen and actually break it down even more and then we can actually pick them up guys and actually you know show them off on the channel so if you did enjoy this video hit the like subscribe button down below i'll see you guys next one peace out